What you guys got another video here for you in this one we're going to be taking a look at how we can enable the f8 function inside a windows 8 operating system now microsoft for some unknown reason have changed this way of getting into safe mode or advanced boot options and it makes it very difficult for people to get in there so what i'm going to do is show you a really easy trick that you can actually do on your system to put it back to the way it used to be in all the other operating systems where you tap F8 and you can get into safe mode or safe mode with networking or safe mode with command prompt and so on okay so let's do that right now we're going to open up a command prompt here I'm on a Windows 8.1 operating system and uh, it will work with Windows 8 as well okay so we're going to come down here and uh, what we're going to do is open up the command prompt and run this as administrator that's important we need to do that so going to say yes here and now we've got our command prompt window open now we need to change uh, a setting and we're going to do that inside here so let me just quickly do that bcd edit like so space forward slash set space bracket default boot menu policy And then legacy just like so now once you've got that typed out you just push enter and you should see operation completed successfully I will put this in the description of the video so you can just copy and paste that straight in there now when we close this off and reboot our system we should be able to just tap F8 So there you see, it just gets straight into the advanced boot options and it's very easy to do now. It's no more hassle, no more bashing that F8 key like mad to try and get in there. It's a much more simpler process, okay? So let's restart our computer and I'll show you how to put it back to the way it was just in case you want to. So I'm just gonna quickly start Windows normally. okay so once we're back at the desktop what we need to do here if you want to put it back to the way it was you need to open up a command prompt with administrator rights again then we need to do bcd edit forward slash set and then bracket default bracket boot menu policy and then standard and you should see the operation completed successfully and that means it's now successful and you're back to the way it was I will put these codes in the video description for you okay so you can just copy and paste them in okay and that's how you basically enable the F8 function inside a Windows 8 or Windows 8.1 operating system. So I hope this helps you out. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. If you enjoy these videos, guys, hit that like button. And also, if you want to keep up to date uh, for my videos when I upload them, then hit the subscribe button and that will keep you up to date, okay? So thanks again for watching, guys, and thanks for your support. Have a great weekend. Bye for now.